joining DDH1, it was probably one of the best decisions I've made, I reckon. I've been working for DDH1 for about a year now. Uh, I really enjoy the job. Uh, I've come across a lot of good mates along the way now. They really look after you here too. They'll, uh, they pay you quite well. They'll, uh, they'll provide you with all the necessary training that's needed. All flights, accommodation, everything's all paid for. The rosters are, are four and two rosters, so 28 days on. Two weeks off gives you a lot of time to do what you want it. And it's always different every day. You, you can do servicing. There's a lot of things that need to be serviced all the time. We uh, add some rods, we drill, we'll pull some tubes, shake the tubes, get all of our product out of the tubes, wash it all off, put them in the trays and send them away. Coming over the west, you get to see a lot of the land. You go to a lot of different places and work is just different every day, I suppose. And there's a lot of good people that you meet along the way too. It's, it's good fun. Yeah. So back at camp, it's, it's pretty good as well. We, uh, we've got caravans for our accommodation. We've got bunk beds in there, so you'll, you'll share with the opposite shift. So you'll share with someone on night shift and you'll be on day shift. So you've always got your own room to yourself and then you've got your facilities as well, your bathrooms and toilets on the side of each van. Uh, the food, it's brilliant. We've got a great chef there. He, um, he's here all through the week and on the weekends, we'll, um, the offsiders will go back and they'll we'll cook for ourselves. We've got the TV set up in there too, so all the sports we can watch when we get home from work. So working for DDH1 has uh, really put my, me on my feet. I, uh, I'm financially stable, I've just purchased my first home. I'm just excited to see what the drilling industry has for me and, uh, and meeting all the cool people on the way too.